short is about typhoon. Typhoon comes from the word typhoon or great wind. Typhoon is the name given to storms that occur in the western Pacific. It is made over the ocean and a type of tropical cyclone. It moves in a circular or spiral system of violent winds, typically hundreds of kilometers or miles in diameter. A typhoon starts when clusters of thunderstorm clouds drift over the ocean. It forms when winds blow to the areas of the ocean where the water is warm. These winds collect moisture and rise, while colder air moves in below. This creates pressure, which causes the winds to move quickly. The more warm air and moisture there is, the more intense the winds. The winds rotate or spin around the eye of a typhoon. Warmer ocean water makes more powerful typhoons, which grows into super typhoons. Typhoons are dangerous. If it reaches land, it will cause damage. Problems like farmers may lose all of their crops due to strong winds and rain will happen. Trees will be uprooted and suffer severe damage. Flooding causes people to drown or be injured. Houses to be completely destroyed through their intense rainfall. Typhoons can also cause animals to drown and damage their natural habitats. Electric posts and power lines can be damaged, so disruptions of power supply and communication lines would be expected. Buildings and houses would be damaged too. Landslides are common. Food shortages, lack of access to medical supplies and care, happen when a typhoon comes. Follow these safety precautions and you will stay safe. First, be updated. Pay attention to the radio or TV about weather reports and warnings. Two, stay indoors and keep calm. Secure your home and make sure to stay away from windows, doors, and dangerous spots. Make sure phones are fully charged. Avoid using it except for serious emergencies. Ready your flashlights and candles in case of a blackout or a power failure. Turn off electrical devices. Don't use gas or electrical appliances that have been flooded. If your house is in a flood prone area, go to higher ground immediately or to the nearest evacuation center. Store or keep potable water that will last for two to three days. Ignoring preparations may result in the deaths of residents in high-risk areas. I hope the information would be useful to you. Always remember to keep safe. Your weather correspondent, Keisha Pak.